All right. We are ready to go. We're locked and loaded. All right, let me just turn on my... All right. That's actually pointing right at us. <laughs> let me turn that off. Let me turn this on. Kind of hard to get this out of the way. Is that better? No, it's right in the. How do we make that better? Well, that's not gonna work. Yeah, I guess that works. All right. So the leaf game is. Oh, let me even check from streaming. And it says Outlast 2 Let's Play. All right, that is not the stream name. How do I change that? Alright, I think it's something to do with YouTube. I don't want to screw it up, so I'm just going to leave it. Alright, it's pretty quick, actually. Okay. We are here. The Maple Leafs are going to play um, at 7. They're already playing almost. They're probably going to get through the anthems. Let's see what they're doing right now if they're talking. They're letting the Leafs on the ice. All right. So I got the lineups here. One thirty left. All right. So I'm going to turn off the camera, and we're going to get right down to business, everyone, ladies and gentlemen. This is the official Leafs live stream. I am nervous as heck right now. So, let's get straight down to business. Oh boy. I am so nervous. I don't know why. But I just am. There's Sean McKenzie. Look at him go. He's actually a... A uh, very good broadcaster. I like to see him um, while he does while he does it. He does a great job, and I give him credit for it. Sorry for making a lot of rustling noises. Six impressive numbers for the Maple Leafs. Even strengths goals are doing pretty well in their first place. Everything else they're pretty much second in, um, based on Tampa playing so well so for the anthems and stuff I'm just gonna shut up so let's read this from my Babcock I like how bad we want to be good I like our leadership I like our depth sometimes I don't like our details I think we got to be a way heavier team being heavy isn't getting a scare and measuring yourself it's a state of mind so Mike Babcock believes in this team he believes that they can go for a cup run he said it earlier in an interview and I believe in him too. I believe in the Maple Leafs. Um, Philip Forsberg right there. And we're gonna have the national anthems play. Strikes and bright stars through the perilous fight. Oh, the realm that we watched was so gallantly shrieking, and the rocket rang
She's got quite the passion. She's a very talented singer. Quite the singer. All right, so I will play the game audio. Um, you'll hear, you'll hear the commentators in the background. I don't want to take the the game audio away from you guys, so I will leave that going. Seven and zero record for the Maple Leafs. It can combine of forty seven goals for the Maple Leafs this season. They are on fire. However, the Predators, with some really good defense right now, they are killing it. The goaltender. In the back of that net, that is the man Pecker Rene himself with a 2.31 goal against average. He's doing well, and I can't wait to see these two teams bash it out. Michael Hutchinson, he's got a 2-2-2 record with a GAA of 3.40. Save percentage of 0.879 and one shutout. Not with the Maple Leafs. Oh, he actually did get that shutout. I apologize. He got the shutout with the Maple Leafs. That was the last game. Toronto Maple Leafs. William Nylander at center. Didn't think that would... Maybe Matthews got tossed out. Hutchinson throwing that one out. There's Ron Hainsey. Finds Austin Matthews. It goes the other way from Philip Forsberg. And he'll throw this one in. Comes around for Victor Arfidson. Takes a shot for the point and this one goes wide. Taken away by Austin Matthews. Back the other way. Matthews shoots! What a save there by Pecorine. And it's on the other side. Nashville picks it up. It's Victor Arvidsson. For Johansson takes a shot in this one wide of the goal. Just missed that top corner. Janssen clears this one out. Both teams will get a change and some fresh legs hit the ice. Hutchinson takes this one out. It's John Tavares dumping it out. Here comes Patrick Marlowe who will lose the puck and it'll come the other way. Sights have falling on the ground there. That was pretty bad for the Leafs there. But a break comes towards Toronto. John Tavares skating for that puck. And a good job to get that one on the glass. John Tavares finds this one. It's Gardner who'll dump it in. Finds Mitch Marner. It's Jake Gardner. Takes a shot and misses the net wide. Comes back for Patrick Marlowe. Trying to get it back to Garner, but this one misses and comes back out. Garner throwing it up to Marlowe. He'll just dump it in to get the change for the Leafs. It's Smith. Throwing it around to a teammate. It gets away and Kadri putting the pressure on P.K. Subban. Subban dumps it around and it comes back. Travis Dermott skating this one back long towards the end zone. And Nashville will get a nice and call. So good pressure from the Maple Leafs so far. I'm seeing some good chances. We had this one good chance by Nashville. Working it in the zone. Trying to get it towards the net. And eventually, they're able to at least get shot off. Now, it doesn't hit the net. But, you know what? It's early in the game. There's lots of opportunities. Let's take a shot. At this one right here, Austin Matthews, really good chance right off the glove of Pekka Rene. And I think that was a really good opportunity for the Leafs. With only two minutes into the game, it can't really say much so far. 
Taking this one away. Nashville tries to break this one out. It's Nazem Kadri. Connor Brown. Launched into the zone. Travis Dermott. Finds Oshiganov. He'll tip this one away and Nashville will get to work. It's at comb. Dumping it down. And this will be an icing call as there looked like a tip, but it'll be an icing call on the Nashville Predators and we'll go back down the ice. A little flashback here. And I, I like the passing so far from the defense. Oh, she can off. Look at that pass to John Tavares. Really good opportunity there. And he is, they are so good as a pairing for passing. It could be the number one. I think Morgan Riley is such a good passer. Now, he's, he's had numerous times where he loses the puck. But I like the way he plays. I like the, the heart he has when he plays. And that's a lot of the least players just trying to get a spot on this lineup, just trying to crack a spot. Ryan Ellis dumping this one in. It comes for Jake Gardner. And he'll lose that puck. The first line back out there for, or at least half of it. Philip Forsberg is out there. Jake Gardner. It's Nikita Zaitsev. Back to Gardner, and they'll just take their time here. Both teams getting a change. Some fresh legs out there. Jake Gardner moving in. And he'll lose room as he doesn't find any openings. Dumping it into the Nashville Predators zone. And these two teams, even though they have very good offense, they have some lethal defense. And I really like the way the, both these teams play. Again, both players, number one defenseman. Here's a chance for Mitch Marner. Throwing it around. It's Patrick Marlowe on the end boards. Trying to dig this one out. Going all the way around. John Tavares finds Patrick Marlowe. He'll launch it around the boards. Ryan Hartman trying to take this one away. It's a turnover. And Marlowe will take the shot and it'll hit off a natural predator. Back the other way. Launching it in the zone. Oshiganov will knock this one down and take it out of the zone himself. Throwing it to Travis Dermott. He's got Janssen. Look at him skate. He really wanted that puck. And the Leafs will lose the puck. It's P.K. Subban who looks like he's been out there for a long time already. Just five minutes in the period. He's had a lot of ice time. Morgan Riley. To Matthews. Matthews shoots off the post. What a good chance by Matthews. Shot right at the goal. and Let's take a look at that one again. What a beautiful chance by Austin Matthews. You don't see too many guys like him taking slap shots from the top of the circle. And that was an odd one. But look at this. He winds her up. Takes a shot. And where is this? Banks right off the bottom of the left post. I don't think Rene had any idea where that puck was. Predators a very good team, and I agree with what he's saying. They are very good in the neutral zone, honestly. They know how to play the puck. They just, they struggle scoring. They are one of the low scoring teams in the league, and I think that's why they lose a lot of games. But there are games where they can score a lot of goals, and we've seen it in numerous NHL games. They've done it a lot. They've done it against the Leafs once, and that was a terrifying game. That was a long time ago. Nazem Kadri takes a shot and banks off. Hainsey trying to get a drive. And this one taken away by the Predators. Here's Kevin Fiello. He'll dump this one in. And he'll get back around. Jake Gardner. Here's Freddy Goche. Goche takes a shot. This one misses the goal around the net. Coming the other way. It's Ryan Ellis. He'll lose this one. It's really hard to learn the names of the Predators. I'm just trying my best. I think for the first period, I'll stick with 
Toronto based names and as soon as they get to the second period I should be refreshed on on their names the least I don't have to look at the paper I think I'm just gonna try memorizing Nashville's that's the hard one the least are easy I know every single Leaf player Even I know Casimir Kaskasu. Please, someone correct me on that backup goalie for the Leafs that camp for the AHL, the emergency backup. Because I am struggling to know what his name is. John Tavares. It's Mitch Marner. He finds his buddy Morgan Riley. Morgan Riley takes a shot and it hits off a shin pad. And it's around the goal. Here's Victor Arvinson trying to find his buddy Philip Forsberg. And this one will get turned around. John Tavares putting on the pressure on... That is Irwin. Matt Irwin. Gives it a... Oh, it's Alice on. Ooh, they, they, switched, they jumbled up the lines. That's okay. I'll just learn them by the numbers. Ellis is four, Matt Irwin's 52. And you know what I realized about Nashville? They have a really, like, older team. They're mixed young and they're mixed old. And that's why they're, that's why they're one of the better teams. They have some veterans that are very experienced. And then they got some guys that are young and fresh. You know, got good, nice... Nice fresh legs that will come out there and go at top speeds. Here's Willie Nylander. I almost said Frederick Nylander. That was almost a big oopsie daisy. A trip and there was no penalty on the on the play. Oh, Giganoff will take this one away. I just need Nashville to get a power play. I know I don't want to say that, but if Nashville gets a power play, I learn all those players on their team. Or at least on their power play. A wacky bounce right there. Rene had, was scrambling towards the goal. And he was lucky to get back. Nazem Kadri keeps this one in. Takes a shot. This one stopped by Rene. Here's a shot now on goal. Ojigano trying to throw this one at the net. Taken away. Craig Smith takes this one back. It's Fiala. Smith with a shot. Stopped there by Michael Hutchinson. The new backup for the Toronto Maple Leafs. He came from the Florida Panthers. We're going to be back in just a sec. 0-0. Zero, zero. It remains for the Toronto Maple Leafs and the National Predators. All right, so I don't want to get, like, copyright. <laughs> so while those commercials play, I'll just I'll just chat. Yeah. I want to wonder, I wonder if my... Um, if my camera's on. It's not on. There's no point of putting on the camera because, look, as soon as I put on the camera, you, you basically can't see me. The video's not working. It's not? No. Nope. We can hear you, but we can't see anything. I can see you moving something around on the screen. That's weird because OBS says it's on. Yeah, it's fine, Dad. I turned it off because it went to commercials. It's working for me. Ooh, I opened Netflix. That is not a good thing to open. All right, let's go back. You know what? I'll just turn off the volume. Alright, so now they're going to flashback. This must be their... The last time the Leafs versus the National Predators. And it doesn't look pretty. He's on the bench right now. As it stands. And you know what? He's a good goalie. I've looked him up before. He's a really good goalie. Good 
John Tavares. It's Mitch Marner now. He drops it back for Tavares. Obviously, Tavares is not ready for that play. But they continue into the zone. Oh, he's right. It is all black. Why is it showing all black? Is it because it's the TV? That's so weird. Why is it not showing? There we go, it's back. It's playing for me. It's not showing. Maybe it's because it's entered a blocked area that OBS can't can't show. It shows it shows YouTube. It just doesn't show Rogers any place TV. That's really odd. Hold on, guys. I'm going to try it on Sportsnet. Let me just close my screen. Now you see my information. <laughs> Man, it's not like it was working anyways. <laughs> uh, mean joke. Alright, Sportsnet. Sportsnet is like Alright, hopefully Sportsnet works. I'm sorry to anyone who's watching and it didn't work. I apologize. I was not aware that it wasn't working. So Nashville's destroying the leads right now. Anybody was wondering. Let's see. There's like Rogers any place TV wasn't working. Let's see if uh, Sportsnet shows up. 
Don't let us down, Sportsnet. Come on. No, what the heck? It won't show videos. It's got to be something with. Why is he not working? Here comes Mitch Marner. Has a look over his shoulder to see where the reinforcements are. He's tied up by Sue. It's working. It just doesn't show videos, and that's so weird. Matias Echo. Waiting back behind his own net. He'll hold on to it there. Echo now starts up. Tried to pass up the middle. Missed everybody. That'll be an icing call against Nashville. Video. This period no, has nothing to do with OBS. Toyota Camry. I think it's because it's locked. And maybe if I tried YouTube live streaming, it would work. Was a chance for Johansson, and I mean, he just missed the net entirely there, and he had all kinds of time. He's still shaking his head over that one. And Johansson loves playing the Leafs. 12 points and 13 games against Toronto. All right. He's looking for his seventh goal against the Blue and White. But... I'm going to have to leave the live stream. I'm sorry. Uh, it didn't work. I didn't obviously do enough research on how to properly do this. Um, next time, I'll probably have to use YouTube. So I'm just going to spend the time testing this right now. And then next time I decide to do this, I'll know what I need to do. Simple as that. All right. Well, thank you for watching who was ever watching. Um, <laughs> I appreciate your company. It makes me feel happier. And I will see you guys in the next one. Take it easy, guys.